Matovich. Good afternoon. Please. Ramzan Akhmatovich. We agreed to meet today and talk about the situation in the Chechen Republic. About the economy. About the social sphere, in general. The dynamics are positive. This is largely thanks to you. Your team. People work confidently. And this is thanks to good interaction with the government of the Russian Federation. We have a number of serious tasks and programs that you yourself talk about all the time. I know that you have prepared a list of issues that you would like to discuss. Please, Vladimir Vladimirovich, good afternoon. Thank you for taking the time to meet. Before I start talking about the Republic, I would like to talk about what we have been doing from the beginning of the special operation to the present day. I even want to brag about both the humanitarian and combat areas. Our squad shows good results there. Every day they take prisoners. Every day they destroy equipment. No Abrams tanks are afraid of us. I believe that we advertised for them. The fighters are in good spirits today. I sometimes check in to see how they are doing. We resolve absolutely all their issues. They don't have any problems with communications or equipment. From the beginning of the operation to this day, we have bought more than 1,100 vehicles, more than 100 of which are armored vehicles from the Republic. We even help other people. This is our common cause. So we must win together. All the people support you, and we are the only region about which I can tell you that we created five regiments and three battalions during this time in the Republic, and they are all fighting in special operations today. Send your best wishes to the guys. Please send your best wishes to their families. I know that you personally deal with these issues all the time, including supporting the families of our guys who are fighting on the front line. They fight confidently, well, courageously and heroically. I am very pleased that your guys have developed very good contacts with other units. I know the attitude of commanders, including those at higher levels. I think I already said, I asked one fighter how the guys from Chechnya fight there. The answer was given at that very second. They will not let us down. We are completely confident in them. You understand, this still says a lot. This is an assessment of commanders who actually take part in hostilities. Therefore, I convey my best wishes to all of them, as well as to their families. Vladimir Vladimirovich, if we do not carry out your order, then we will not live in this state. We will fulfill your order 100%. Thank you, and in my opinion, you also assess the situation in the Republic as a whole in exactly the same way. We don't have any special problems in our Republic. We solved all the problems a long time ago. Now there are technical issues on which, as always, I need your help.